Welcome back to the channel, you guys. Welcome back to the boat gang. All right, um, I got the oxy digger out here at the park pond. It's a little pond for this big boat, but uh, we're gonna give it a rip. I'm gonna do some ovals. I got the turn fin on there. We're gonna do some ovals with uh, Octura 645. Not the best prop for this boat, but it's a, basically a bash session. So let's freaking go. Let's go. Try my best not to wreck it. I'm gonna do a couple laps, get a feel for it, because I hadn't run it in a while. There we go, baby. This boat right here is one of the only large scale wood riggers that comes fully assembled. Fully assembled, ready to go. You can also get a, a builder's kit, you know? at Oxdean Marine. Go check them out. Bill will hook you up now. It's uh, it's actually, in person, this boat is actually uh, impressive. Very impressive. The build quality, the performance, I think 109 or 112 was my PB with this boat. I can't remember. I've upgraded the electronics in it. And um, kind of ironcladded her out a little bit. You know what I'm saying? But out the box, it was fast. I think out the box, my PB was like 102, you know? And I was trying for some extreme speed, which I'm not done yet. Kind of waiting for some warmer weather to do some speed runs. Yeah, that prop makes her want to bounce a little bit, but I don't even care. It's like a bash session, you know? I could tune her in for that, but um, I kind of, oh. <laughs> I could tune her in for that. <laughs> I kind of got it set up for speed runs and I'm doing ovals, you know what I'm saying? I didn't really mess with the strut. When I, before I left the house, all I did was throw the turn fin on, kind of check my center of gravity with the battery I'm running, you know? Running a little, it looks like she's running a little wet, to be honest with you. But it's that prop, like I said. Might do a prop change on the next battery. This thing is impressive, man. It's the head turner. It needs a big pond. If you got a little pond, this ain't the boat for you. But it's actually, it's actually very, very affordable. I mean, it's like right at $500, but you can catch them on sale every now and then. Comes with a 2000 kV motor, a Sea King 180. Yeah. Whoa, 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 baby. You gotta be careful in here. I'll hit a damn Christmas tree and tear the whole, whole front of the boat off. Or the fountain. With an ABC, like 1616, I could just about go around this pond right here at wide open throttle. It's so freaking controllable. With the right prop on, I just wanted to kind of bash it today. You know what I mean? Give her a little bash session. Yeah, with the ABC prop, it don't have that hop in the back, you know? <laughs> I love this boat. My fastest boat. This is the fastest boat I own in my fleet. This is the fastest boat. Second fastest is the Blackjack 42. Third fastest is the Velez 29. A hydroplane is the fastest, it's the fastest RC boat on the water, basically. I mean, there's some catamarans that'll keep up with them. But uh, like glued down to the water, you can't beat a damn hydroplane. Uh, well, rigger, excuse me, excuse me. A rigger is the fastest boat on the water, period. Hydro style, not a lot of surface, for air to catch up under it, you know? And uh, they glue, they just glue down. That was a full trigger rip there. I 
have an SRD V3 with me. Probably throw that on with an ABC prop next. I'll go over my setup here in just a second. This is just a cheap RC LiPo. She'll just glue to the damn water, man. That's about our battery, I'm sure. So I'm gonna bring her in and we're going to throw an ABC prop on with an SMC SRD, okay? I got an XLX2 in here, <laughs> she's heavy. I got my little shrimp outrigger. This is the difference in those two holes right there. I mean, this little boat, <laughs> it's, it's nothing, it's nothing. That glare was in the screen. You guys can see how much larger this boat is. Or at least I hope you can. All right, so uh, let's get this out the way. Let's get the little twin cat set aside. Whoa, geez. And we'll open this one up. This is the Velez 29 stand. It actually works pretty good for this boat. I know it's probably it's probably glaring on the screen. I don't even need to check temperatures. XLX2 40, 60, 20, 80 kV CM motor in this thing, and uh, I was running this RC Lipo. Okay. We'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Go check out Oxdean Marine. This boat's completely boss. <laughs> Fastest period. Fastest boat period. Uh, thanks for watching.